piece of the bars right out of the oven. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I'm gonna put them in the fridge for about an hour before we cut them. Today I am making chocolate pecan pie bars and I'm going to make the bottom first. So we need one cup of flour. And a third cup of light brown sugar packed. And a fifth cup of butter melted. We're gonna mix that in here. So we're making the shortbread crust. So mix that up. And this makes an eight by eight pan. So we're making the shortbread crust and this will be nice and crumbly. Then we're gonna bake this for 15 minutes at 350. And then I'm gonna mix up the uh, insides while we do that. These are gonna be super, super good. Great to feel like pecan pie with a little bit of chocolate. Okay, so we're going to add that into an eight by eight pan. We're going to use our fingers to press it down. Like okay, so we're going to bake this at 350 for 15 minutes, and then we're going to get together the actual. inside part. We're going to use the same bowl. It's not going to hurt anything. Two eggs. Two tablespoons of light cream. This is tablespoons. What I like about this recipe is it does not use the heavy corn syrup. Okay. Half a cup of brown sugar. Packed. And then we're gonna use a fourth cup of the um, corn syrup. Like I said, it doesn't use a lot of it, so but you do need it for the consistency. So I'm gonna go grab that. So it's a fourth cup. That one's about gone. So we'll open up the new one. And then a teaspoon of vanilla. Okay, we're gonna mix that together. And then you're gonna add one cup of chopped pecans. So 
one cup of these. And I get these at all these. That's the cheapest place to buy nuts. Okay. And then a third cup of chocolate chips. Second part of the recipe now. So we're going to take it out of the oven. it out. Okay, what's my timer on? Hold on. Okay, and then we're going to take a few more pecan pieces. And just kind of like sprinkle over the top. The chocolate chips are kind of already mixed in. Now we're going to bake it 20 to 25 more minutes until firm and it sets around the edges and just a little bit soft in the middle. And then when it's done, we're going to refrigerate for one hour before you even cut it. And these get stored in the refrigerator. And when they come out, I will show you the finished product. And within 10 minutes of prep and 30, 40 minutes of cooking, you have these awesome chocolate pecan by par pecan pie bars. And if you do not like the chocolate in them, just completely omit the, omit the chocolate chips and you'll be just fine. So I'll show you this wonderful recipe as soon as they're done.